Tesla will have the best headlights on the market. Nicholas Caballero from Torque News Tesla reporting team says your headlights are one of your vehicle's most important safety features. Their brightness can be the difference between a clear view of the road ahead at night and the ability to detect other vehicles, pedestrians, animals or obstacles and react to time in time to avoid them and avoid being involved in a collision because you weren't able to see in the darkness. Tesla is updating the entire Model S, Model 3, Model X and Model Y lineup with exterior and interior tweaks as part of its overall update refresh. Welcome back dear friends, this is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our uh, channel for daily Tesla news and ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage. Nicholas Caballero reports that Tesla will have the best headlights on the market after this update. Caballero says since Tesla officially launched the Model 3 2021 refresh in October 2020, new headlights on the electric car were seen sporadically. However, the updated design has been inconsistently spotted in some markets, but not in others. Hella, who will be supplying the Samsung headlights to Tesla, has an adaptive headlight system that gives more visibility in dark, challenging driving conditions. The adaptive headlight mechanism would increase the effectiveness of the headlamps on the Model 3 and Model Y. The Model 3 already has the highest rating for its headlights based on the IAHS assessment of the vehicle. Based on the latest information at the time of this reporting, the Tesla Model Y and Model 3 Refresh are now offering adaptive headlights. For those new to this adaptive headlight idea, the lamps will follow the curve of the road and give a more solidified and lit up field with vision. Uh, the latest inter-iteration of the Tesla Model 3 and Model Y headlights includes a projector lamp. Previously, Model 3 and Model Y headlights were fully LED. Feedback from Tesla owners might have pushed Tesla to migrate towards the more powerful projector reflector headlamps. Some Tesla Model 3 owners have confirmed that the new Model 3 headlights are not Xenon, just projector headlamps. The updated headlight design feature is a more powerful and def um, defined beam that has a squarer pattern than the previous Model 3 headlights. According to Xenopro.com, if your car is equipped with projector headlights, it is best to upgrade your lights to HIDs. Although LEDs will fit and work from experience, they will not perform as expected. In most cases, your stock halogen bulbs will be brighter than LEDs in projector type headlights. Other vehicles like the Mercedes-Benz GLA have headlights that feature the same XCRERTV code and the new mod in, uh, as the new Model 3 vehicles. The luxury SUV from the veteran German automaker features headlights that have features like country mood, motorway mood and active light function. Friends, projector headlights are brighter than reflector headlights and they are less likely to blind oncoming traffic. They are significantly brighter than reflector headlights. They are less likely to blind other drivers basically because they are directed downwards toward the road so they don't shine in other drivers eyes. They also give off a more even light. Considering all others, all of this, this it's clear that projector headlights are better than reflector headlights. Hella, for who will be supplying the Samsung headlights to Tesla, has an adaptive headlight system that gives more visibility in dark, challenging driving conditions. The adaptive headlight mechanism would increase the effectiveness of the headlamps on the Model 3 and Model Y. An interesting side question would be how many lumens is ideal. Any guys, any idea? Let me know, friends, please, in the comment section below. Generally, it differs from state to state and jurisdiction to jurisdiction, but the average and safe lumen in car headlights should be between 2,000 to 4,000 lumens. 
Now, according to teslarati.com, the Tesla Model 3's headlights received a good rating, the highest possible score from the IIHS due to their impressive visibility when testing on straightaways and curves. Among the cars that the IIHS tested, the Model 3's headlights provided the best, hitting the right amount of illumination without being too bright for other motorists. A vehicle's headlights can obtain one of the four IHS rating good acceptable marginal and poor a little bit ago when I said that according to teslarady.com the model 3's headlights received a good rating that means it was the highest possible score from the IIHS now um, uh, a vehicle's headlights like I said can obtain one of the four IHS ratings good acceptable marginal and poor the car is then placed on a set starting point and rated to lux a unit of measurement for headlights by the way when we say lux luxurious we think of like a high living right but did you know that the word lux in Latin means uh, light and luxurious in reality means full of light which is a very positive uh, positive things if you refer to the right meaning of the word now in other um, in order to obtain a good rating from IHS uh, the headlight must provide 500 feet of illumination on a straightaway and between 225 to 275 feet of light all while emitting five locks of light friends Tesla seems to be trying to improve on perfection making its cars even safer than and they already are. We can conclude that depending on some parameters like the model, the market and the delivery date, Tesla will once again be ahead of the battery electric vehicle competition, this time because on a key feature headlights. What do you think friends? Have you been happy with your Tesla headlights? What has been your experience with your headlights? Let us know please in the comment section below. I will look forward to reading your comments. You know in the meantime there is another additional news. I reported uh, partly yesterday that Tesla CEO Elon Musk disclosed that he is confident that the chip shortage is going to be solved in the short term despite many people disagreeing. You know uh, chip is another important part just like the headlight of a vehicle especially in tesla this virus situation has resulted in an increased demand for many electronics and computers that the supply chain of cars couldn't handle especially the semiconductor industry this microchip shortage in turn affected the automotive industry which has increasingly become a big consumer of microchips we previously released a deep dive report on how the chip shortage is affecting electric vehicle production as several automakers had to halt production until chip supply could catch up uh, uh, and earlier this year Tesla CEO Elon Musk confirmed that it is affecting Tesla as well but he believes it's not long term when discussing Tesla performance this quarter Elon Musk said that Tesla's current biggest challenge is the supply chain issue especially microcontroller chips he said our biggest challenge is supply chain especially microcontroller chips never seen anything like it fear of running running out is causing every company to over order like the toilet paper shortage but at epic scale that said it's obvious not a long-term issue uh, two days ago at a tech conference in Italy I think it was yesterday Elon Musk again commented on the timeline and claimed that it should be fixed by next year with new factories coming up there is a lot of chip fabrication plants that are being built and I think we will have good capacity by next year's um, yeah, I think Elon Musk's uh, outlook is more optimistic than several other industry leaders who see the issue lasting up to 2023. Well, friends, let me know your thoughts. What do you think about this chip shortage? And also, what do you think about Tesla's headlights? Have you been happy with yours? Um, let me know in the comments section below, please. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news and give us thumbs up, please. Tweet it out. We would greatly appreciate it. I'll see you soon in our next report. Peace be with all of you. God bless you all.